everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a really exciting video, but first I want to apologize if the coloring is really bad in this video. I live in Florida and we just had a hurricane come through and since hurricane season doesn't end till the end of the month, we're leaving up our shutters just until the end of this month when hurricane season's over because it takes so long to put them up. It's just easier. So there's no natural light in this house whatsoever. So if I am kind of orange, I apologize, but we're just going to have to live with that. So I'm doing the best I can right now with lighting, but yeah. So I didn't block out my freaking address on this package. So I got <laughs> a package from, can you read it on the side? It doesn't even say. It's from ColourPop. Um, they had this really good sale going on, and I'm going to pull it up on my phone so I can tell you how much everything was. Actually, I think sometimes their stuff has the prices in it, or like a paper that says the prices that you paid for everything. And I went on, because I've been using, I don't, you probably won't be able to tell, but my makeup right now is ColourPop. I bought a bunch of stuff after watching um, a YouTuber... I feel really bad because I'm going to forget her name again, and that makes me sad. But this freaking YouTuber who lives in Miami who I love, hold on, I'm going to pull up her, her name real fast because I love her so freaking much, and I feel bad that I'm blanking. Whenever I turn on the camera, I just go blank, and I can't remember anything. It's horrible. I'm just a horrible, horrible person. Oh my god, it's Kathleen Lights. I'm such an idiot. Anyways, I was watching one of Kathy Light's videos a couple months ago where she was doing like her favorites and I've been waiting for her to do a new favorites and then I went and bought a bunch of stuff and I've been wearing them and I'm obsessed. So I was like, I only bought a couple of things because I wanted to try it out and I was obsessed. So I went back on and I was just looking to see what they have. I always check their clearance stuff. And they're having like a huge clearance like sale and a bunch of their stuff was on sale. So I, I went a little ham. But everything was like up to 70% off, and I only got things that were like $3. I think like one of the most expensive things I bought was like 5 And I bought 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 12 things? I bought 12 things. So I ain't mad. So oh, without further ado, this is what it looks like on the inside. All my goodies. All these are flipped upside down, and it does have a paper. That tells me the prices, right? It tells me the prices of everything I bought? No, it doesn't. Okay, so I will pull that up on my phone because the prices were ridiculous. I'm like screaming at my... I'm sorry to be screaming. I'm just excited. I've been waiting for this package to come since the day I bought it. I wanted it immediately because I've been really into playing with my makeup, especially for like... I know it's only like September, but it's fall. I don't know if you guys can tell, but there's like a pumpkin over here, and like there's a whole shelf up here that's all decorated for fall. And, ugh, I've just been playing with my fall makeup, like to do fall looks, and I realized I didn't have a dark red, which is why I originally went on there. And, um, okay, cool. This has everything in the prices I paid for it. It doesn't have like the original price, but it'll show me what I paid for it. So, the first thing on here is actually the thing that's on top. It's the last thing I got because it was the smallest eyeshadow I got, but it was only $1.80. And this is the dark red I bought because I realized I bought some colors that were very fall inspired, but I still didn't get a dark red like I wanted. So, this bad boy is called Too Much. It's just one of their, like, tiny pan shadows. It's not like a super shock or anything, but it's really pretty, and it looks like it's a burgundy wine color with gold flecks of glitter. I'm just going to swatch. Oh, God, they're so buttery. So, that's what it looks like. Let's see if lighting will do you justice. Oh, my God, that's exactly what I need. I'm so I tried to do a dark red right here, but you can't see it because, again, didn't have a dark red, so it didn't come out the way I wanted. So I, can't, I cannot wait to play with these. Okay. So that was the first one I bought, and it was $1.90 for this shadow. Or no, $1.80. God. So the next one I got is Left on Thread, which, I don't know what this was. God, that color's great. This is a um, Super Shock shadow, and this was $3.60. I think they're normally, like, I'm putting freaking eyeshadow on the box already. I think they're normally, like, 
because my stuff's gonna get so dirty. I I didn't plan this out. I want to swatch them all, but now I realize there's gonna be swatches all over me. So this is what it looks like. That is not gonna do it justice. God dang the lighting in here. Are you gonna be able to see? Oh my god. She's like a turquoise green. Oh, there you go. That's that's a good shot. Oh my god, she's so pretty. She was one of the last ones I got because I was like, I'm never going to wear this color, but I decided to get uh, these two colors because I was like, I wanted to play with them and try to do, like, come out of my comfort zone, and this is definitely, this is butter. First of all, I just want to say, it is buttery, but she is beautiful. I'm going to do stuff with her. That sounded weird, but I'm going to do stuff with her. I'm excited because I got another color, which I think will be the next one I show you. Pretty sure she's next on the list because I got them together because I was like, maybe I could do something with both of them. And it's called Fantasy. Fantasy, where are you, girl? Um, fantasy. And she was only $3 for this super shock shot. God, she's flipping gorgeous. Oh my god. She is like this, I don't even know, like an electric fuchsia color? I don't, I don't even know how to describe it. But almost like... The purple they use at like Disneyland for either Maleficent or um, the Haunted Mansion. I know that sounds weird, but that's the vibe it gives me when I look at it. It's coming out too dark. It is like flipping. Hold on. Maybe if I swatch. <laughs> I don't want to mix colors. Okay. Oh, you are so pretty. Oh, okay. You see that? Yes. There we go. That's more accurate to what she looks like. She's amazing I'm trying to get like no the light's just turning it blue it is so pink like if Barney was on crack or something like oh there no still this lighting oh is gonna be the end of me okay I'm gonna have swatches like all over me because I'm trying to clean off my fingers I'll have to use the bed don't tell my husband okay so the next color is actually a lipstick, and it's called Sachet. Which one is Sachet? Sachet. Okay, because I wanted a dark, vampy red lip, because I apparently don't own a dark, vampy red lip, so I think I actually got two. But this one, is this one a lipstick? This is a lipstick, which I went through the list, and I thought it ended... Oh, who's this by? This is just a luxe lipstick. It's not a collab with anybody. This is freaking gorgeous! It's like rose gold with stars. I don't even care what the color looks like. I'm so impressed. Oh, she's so pretty. She does have, like, that weird water thing everybody's talking about, but I live in Florida, and it's hot as fuck. So I feel like I'm not worried about that. It's literally just water. Bitch, you get over it. Ooh, she... I want to put her on, but I know I'm going to, like, fuck up my lips. And it's just going to look weird. And I don't want to, like, mess up my lips on camera because then I'd be upset. That's beautiful. Oh, my God. That is... This packaging, though. If, you guys, can you see? It's just going to reflect. It's so pretty. So happy right now. I'm so happy right now. So the next thing... Oh, wait. How much did I pay for that? So that was Sachet, the lipstick. It was $4.50. Probably one of the best $4.50 I've ever spent. So the next one is Va Va Boom, and it is one of their So Juicy Lip Plumper, uh, like, lip glosses, right? What does it say? It is a Your Lips But Better, and I got it in the orange color Va Va Boom because it was cheapest. I think the other ones were, like, $4.50 for the other colors, and this one is an orange, and it was only $3.50, and I was like, I just wanted it to make my lips plump. So, I didn't care what color I got, because I feel like this is the kind of product where I might actually put it on, let it plump my lips, and then take off the product and put something else over it. Okay, we'll do it on the bottom end. Why is this one so hard to get into? I don't want to... Okay, there we go. So, this looks like this, and it is... There you go. That's a good way to look at the color. It's really pretty. You might do this right now, just because I really... All I have is like lip gloss, or not lip gloss, but like a chapstick type thing on my lips. So I want to see how this one works. Not that it matters where I get it, but. Ooh, 
This reminds me of a lipstick I got around Christmas when I was a teenager one year. I remember there was this one, like, Christmas where I wore, like, this mint lip gloss from, actually, I think it was from Lane Bryant. And this reminds me a lot of that. I got a little on my tongue because I can feel it, and my tongue feels really minty now. I don't think you need as much as I put on. I put it on like if it was a um, lip gloss, and I don't think you need that much. Ooh, I can feel her, though. She doesn't sting. It literally feels like minty on my lips. She's going to be reflective for the rest of the video, though. And that product was $3.50, so I think I got another lip product. Yeah, I got another lip product. So the next thing I got was an eyeliner. I was so excited to see that they had eyeliners on there because I've always wanted one from there. And I put a black one in my cart, but I didn't want it nearly as much as the brown. And by the time I got to my checkout, it had sold out. So I was actually not too upset by that. But I did get this brown one in Brouhaha, which, oh my god, I freaking love that name. So this is one of their cream gel liners. And I got this for $2.75. Yeah, they had a lot of different colors, but I just wanted a basic eyeliner to wear, so, <sighs> nice little tip. Oh, oh, that's even creamier than I expected it to be. Oh, wow. Oh, I'm so excited. I've heard people say that their eyeliner is incredible, but, oh my god, it is probably the most buttery, like, glidey thing I've ever felt. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Wait, is this top part like an eraser? Or not eraser, I'm going to sharpener. No, it's just empty. Whatever. Okay, I don't care. I'm I'm super stoked with... I don't know if you've noticed, but like everything I've gotten so far, I'm super stoked with. Obviously, I came back for more stuff from them because I've been using their stuff and I really liked it. But now I'm even more excited. I'm just, I'm so excited. What's the next thing I got? I have so much more to go through in this tiny little box. Next thing is Honor Roll. Which one of you was Honor Roll? This one. Which is like, I think it's the brown I got. So, when I bought my original pack of colors, I bought like two golds and then like two glittery reds. And the golds I got are freaking gorgeous. The reds are good, but they're not like, they're like pink reds with like a rainbow glitter. And I was like, I need something darker to do my corners. And, oh, this is glittery. I don't know. That's actually a pretty good image of it. Okay, this one's a bit firmer than the others. Oh, but she still glides so good. Really pretty, like, true brown. I, with, like, I don't know, it's not rainbow. Um, what is that color where it has all the colors? A holographic glitter. It has holographic glitter in it. Yeah, that one's definitely like a brown with holographic glitter, which again, not mad at, because whenever I put a glitter on my eyes in ColourPop, I feel like it kind of goes everywhere anyway, so my whole eye looks glittery, which I'm not mad at, because it makes a statement. That's really pretty. That's like the perfect neutral brown to just do my corners in, which is why I got it. It was 360 The next thing I got is a lip, I think it's a satin lipstick called Wig. For $4.90. I think I want to say that's the most expensive thing I bought is this lipstick. And this is a Bretman Rock collab with ColourPop, I'm guessing. And this is what this looks like. Beautiful, kind of like flamey. Okay, let's, I want to see what the color is. So the color is called Wig, but... It showed it as a really dark kind of red, so I'm going to put it next to the other lipstick. I'm so happy. That is so pretty. Like, I thought the lipstick was beautiful. Oh, my God. I, wanted, I just want to put all of this on my face right now, which would look ridiculous, but I cannot wait to play with all this. Oh, my God. It's so pretty. Oh, my God. That was... I'm so excited. I'm pretty sure this is a satin lipstick, though. Does it say on it? It says, Ultra Satin Lip. I'm so excited, because I'm pretty sure satin lips dry kind of matte, so obviously they have a satin finish, but I don't think it's going to stay, like, glossy like my lips are right now. I will say, I've had this on for a while, 
I don't think they're going to get much plumpier. I think it's just kind of like a minty feeling over your lips. Not bad. Um, not as harsh as the one by... Oh, what is that other brand that has like that really big one? Because they theirs like stung my lips when I used to use it, which I liked because I could feel it working. This just... I don't know if you can tell how much bigger my lips are, but I do like it. I feel like I would put it on, but I feel like this is one of those ones, if you put it on and then wiped it off, you it wouldn't stay as plump for as long, because I feel like it kind of has to sit on there to keep it plump. So that's the only thing I'm going to say about this, but I don't mind it at all. And I don't mind the orange color, because I haven't gotten to it yet, but a bunch of my colors are kind of orangey related. So the next one is a Super Shock Shadow called Let Me Pass, which is probably the one I'm most excited about. I'm so, wait, wait, no, 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 okay, so this is the image, you guys can't see that at all, okay, you see how orange that is, like how it's an orangey burnt yellow, it does not look like that in this package, I'm gonna be so sad if it doesn't look like this burnt orange one that I wanted to buy, because this was the color I was most excited, this just looks like a freaking, like, dark gold, so, it just looks like, let's see, I'm not going to pass any judgment until I try it. It's just a freaking gold. It's just another gold, like, it's just another, I don't know. I was really hoping for, like, a burnt mustard color. Like, I was so stoked for that. I don't think, hold on, I'm going to look at the picture and the swatch on my hand and see if they look. Oh, this looks like a burnt freaking pumpkin. It looks gorgeous, and this is just like, I don't know, really goldy. Well, I mean, it's still a beautiful color. I'm still going to use the crap out of it for fall, but it's not what I wanted. So, that's a bummer. I'm kind of sad about that. I was so excited for that color. The next one is called, oh, that was $3.60 for that Super Shock. And this one is called All In. It was also 360. I'm sorry if you hear my cat. He's literally sitting over here on the floor playing with plastic bags. I don't know why he's been obsessed with plastic bags lately. So this is All In, and it is a... It looks darker than the image. The image showed it as being kind of like a glittery plum. And this one looks like a very vampy glittery plum, which honestly would not be mad at at all i have got to clean up all my fingers they're just like covered and stuff now let's go with the thumb oh she purdy i'll put you up here next to the lipstick oh she's so purdy wait let's see oh this is this is just the worst and you can't get your angles right let's see if you can see it in the uh pan it's see it just looks brown it doesn't look vampy enough it's really pretty, and it's like kind of like a purple red that's very vampy, kind of like the first lipstick that I swatched is kind of what the color looks like. It's very pretty. Okay, I still have two more shadows left to go. The next one is called ZZZ, and it was three dollars and sixty cents. That's this one. Hi, Gabriel. You gonna knock on my makeup off the bed? That sounds like something you would do. So. Kind of like a champagne off rose gold it looks much darker in the pan as well not that i'm mad at that but it just i don't know it kind of looks oh see it looks perfect on screen for you guys but he's fine my fingers are so dirty okay we're gonna go with this one. Oh, that one is so soft holy crap that one's soft um i don't even know where to okay we're just gonna put you next to the gold show the difference um yeah, awkward hand. Actually, it looks very rose goldy on um, on screen and on my hand, so I'm not mad at that either. These are all really pretty colors. I think they're all going to go really well together, especially for fall. I think I can make some really good looks with them. So, oh yeah, so does this one on the bed. So the last one I got is White Rabbit, which was actually the first thing I put in my bag. And this is kind of like a, 
burnty red orange kind of I mean they all look pretty much not the same they don't all look the same at all unlike my first batch of colors these all look very much different it's gonna be so pretty together but this one is just I don't know kind of like a super burnt kind of red kind of kind of brickish kind of very much like a shiny brick can I get that that's not a bad image of it that's yeah pretty much what it looks like we're gonna go with we're gonna go with this one. Another oh, she pretty. So this one doesn't look like it has like glitter in it. It's just freaking metallic-y. Oh, so pretty. My the metallic ones are actually my favorite over the ones with tons of glitter. Okay, so this one actually looks like what was that one that I did? The the orange one that I wanted to be really orange and I said it was kind of bricky. This looks just like that. But just slightly red pinker and without glitter and it's just metallic because you can see them one on top of each other so very very pretty color oh i'm really really excited about this oh my gosh okay so that is all of the things that i got from ColourPop. my total came to like 41 dollars and 45 cents not bad at all for, what did I say, like 13 things? Did it say how many? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. For 12 items. Not bad at all. I'm super excited. I cannot wait to play with all this stuff. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited. Okay, so, um, I don't know if ColourPop still has, um, stuff on sale. I know when I was on their website, like, looking at things, certain colors were selling out before I even got to buy them. So I would definitely say if you are interested, go look. And if you really like ColourPop's shadows, which I probably recommend these over any shadow I've ever used, definitely go back kind of frequently and like check their clearance. I I've been doing it for like the last two like last two months since I made my previous order because oh so worth it. I just I was hoping to catch stuff on sale and I caught stuff on sale and. There was so much stuff on sale, like so much stuff. I was very picky with what I got. Um, so I'm I'm freaking stoked. And if you guys want to see any specific makeup looks with any certain colors, let me know. Maybe, maybe we'll make that happen because I'm really into playing with makeup lately. So, yeah. Um, I will see you guys in the next video. I know I haven't been posting a lot, but maybe, maybe we'll post. I'm not going to make any promises because you never know. So, yeah. If you like this video be sure to leave a thumbs up and if you'd like to subscribe please join our family i would love that and i'll see you guys in the next video bye